Okay, don't pass judgement. This was free on the Epic Games Store, and... I thought to myself, why the fuck do I even use Epic Games? It's called Horace, so how bad can it be? Okay, let's start a new game. Let's go, Horace. Whatever Horace is about. Look at this dimly lit room. Oh, wow. Madness. Horace. Is it a software? Am I a software? Oh, lights are on. What's going on here? Are we building Optimus Prime? Oh, no, we're building a Lego man. I can just pause it by pressing Y. That's really weird. I am Horace 1. Oh, I'm a robot. Am I? I'm Horace the robot. Hello. It me. Why does that pause it? I don't understand. It reminds me of really old DS games, to be honest. Hello there, boys. What are you saying? I'm in a box. I'm off to go find myself a home. Maybe I'll work for Google. You dropped me there. Now I'm mentally unhinged. Now I'm gonna take over the world. Let's go. This is a bit of a shit van, to be honest. Is it a, is it a Ford Transit? That um, Is that a Ford? Jesus Christ, that's a very subtle pedophile joke. He's smoking a grit. We're in the distant future where people have robots and shit and people still smoke. He's finishing his grit before he answers the door. Like, he, 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 he's not feeling answering that door, man. He's got a butler for that shit. How you doing, boy? Why? Don't smoke, mate. Just don't. That's what he's saying. Horace. Oh, no. He doesn't look happy. Maybe he's out of a job, the butler fuck. Why am I naked? Did they give me robot dick? Oh, God. Why am I in creep mode? What on earth? And so, I was born. The first people I remember seeing were the old man, the old lady, and their daughter, Heather. Heather. <laughs> Only the daughter gets the, the name. Man powered me down so he could install some software. I could tell they were nice people. The old man didn't give me a silly voice or stupid personality, and the old lady didn't dress me like a clown. Although for some reason, Heather really didn't like me. You're a robot. The old man asked me to dash from one end of the room to the other. What a strange tutorial. Oh, look at that! We're going! Zoom! This is a really large room. Next. The old man spent a couple of hours building some wooden platforms. He said he wanted me to jump up them. Come on, Horace. Let's go. We me. I don't even need to do the climb. I can jump. This is a really large, like, room. I don't understand. The old man then rearranged the platforms. He told me to try to reach the other end of the room without touching the floor. Heather said, the floor's made of lava. The old lady arranged some pillows and blankets. She said it was in case I fell, but I think she just wanted it to look more like lava. Why does it keep pausing on its own? Oh, that was easy. Why do they have this many pillows and blankets, though? When I reached the other side, the old man just smiled and said, that'll do. For now. Learning to walk. I, I thought I just did that. Me, Horace, the Grand Sir. Wow, it's really snowing out there. Shit, me. Christmas time in that. Wow. Look at all those dinky snowflakes. Kids getting their unicorns, their turkeys. In a minute, we're going to see someone with a gigantic dildo. I am the Christmas present. Do I get to eat? For a while. <laughs> what is this game? Before he worked here, he'd gotten in with Ford some Transit, the pedo vans out. The Why is there a bank robbery going on? Oh, oh okay. That makes reason. perfect sense. Why have you still got the number plate on it if you're gonna? Video of his band. I'm sure some people must like it, but I just found it terrifying. Then there was Alice. She was the cook. She was a nice old lady when she was young. I don't even know what I'm looking at half the time. Then, years later, she heard a small part in Coronation. <laughs> Mr. Silton said, before she worked for the old man, Alice was quite a hoarder. She kept old newspapers and bicycles. And something about a pool in a shoebox. The next morning, the old man gathered everyone together to show them what I was capable of. World domination. So... Ow. It is time to abscond! Hello! Everybody clapped, except the important looking men. Why are the men Not in black exactly here? What are they doing? The man in grey laughed. What kind of artificial intelligence was that? He asked. Move right, unless there's something in the way. Okay, okay, said the old man. 
he turned to me and whispered, they're going to make it quite a bit tougher, but I'm sure you'll be fine. Ow. Oh, shit. Oh. Ow. Jesus Christ, this is difficult. Okay. Ow. Hello, it is May. Well, hey! Ow. 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 <laughs> Jesus, where does that thing come from? Ah, oh, shit. Why can't I just break the boxes in? That surely... I don't understand. Who made these super laser things? Ah, oh, shit. Horace is a gigantic gimp. Ha! Take that, you capitalist pig. Ah, oh, shit. They're torturing a robot. Like we might have a winner after all, said the man in black. There are other robots. It's no kill by 3000, but you can almost see the fire in its eyes. <laughs> Horace is in love with the music, man. Classic Horace. Yes. Oh, no, he's discovered gaming. Is that Pong? Jesus Christ. Table tennis for two, as opposed to table tennis for six. Table tennis time. Oh, no. Table tennis. I don't understand. Oh, no. Hello there, table tennis man. I have won a table tennis. Her mum and dad had bought her a camera and arranged a day up by the sea so that Heather could take some photos, although I really don't think she wanted any pictures of me. I enjoyed being outside. Although, the old lady kept telling me to be careful of the rickety old walkways. Is an old man gonna die now? Please. It moi, Horace! Ha ha ha! I didn't see what happened, but the metal platform Heather was climbing on had collapsed. She was safe, even if the rocks she was on looked very dangerous, so I offered to climb down and get her. The old man agreed, but said I should be careful, as Heather doesn't have infinite lives. Like I do. She didn't even like me anyway. Hang on a minute. Why is everything a platform? I don't. Oh. When have you ever gone to a beach that looks like this? Why, why? Why was there a zappy thing there? It was broken, so I picked her up as gently as I could. I decided it would be best if I didn't run the rest of the way. Ah, shit. Ha. Ah. It me, the boys. The ambulance had arrived by the time I had made it back to the cliff top. Goodbye, Heather. I hope you die. I orchestrated this plan. I did the dirty deed. You're welcome. I did it for the sake of friendship, I promise. <laughs> robot saves local girl. Mechanical man to the rescue. Hero robot, hero bot. <laughs> it looks like a Lego man. I'm a robot. Zoom. Zoom. Meow. Meow. Pussy! Yeah, dick cheese it me, the the man. She's jumping. Once got to know me. We became good friends. Yeah, yes. We enjoyed the same films and TV. After a while, she became very interested in how I worked. Soon she knew as Ah, oh, she's seen it. She's robot. seen the robot dick! The robots even have penises. My name Horace. Couple of months visiting other countries. I don't know what they're doing in this country. The old man always liked to pick interesting locations. He had explained the basics of mathematics to me at the Great Pyramid of Egypt. The Great Pyramid of Egypt! <laughs> Talking what? history in the dead of night, surrounded by mysterious giants. The bit of stone! Bam. Nearly hit the Rolls Royce with that bowling ball. He thought for a bit, then said, So you want to be a real boy? Yes, I want Which to be a real boy. Which confused me even more. Eventually, the old man said, For now, I want you to help clean things around the house. My destiny is grand. I must have looked unimpressed. As he then said, Okay, I want you to clean one million things. It didn't sound like the meaning of life. But I suppose you've got to start somewhere. Learning my purpose. Oh, look at that cleaning. 
This is easy. Where is he even putting all this stuff? Is he eating it or something? Look at the absolute moves that he's doing. Why is there a car up there? Look at that absolute surgeon, sirs. Hello. There must be more rubbish. For some reason, he wants me to pick up his car. Now, I don't understand where he thinks I'm going to put that in my pockets. My car is upstairs. I don't know how it got there. Pretty much an expert of picking up vehicles. Yes, I am an expert of picking up vehicles. You've tortured me to be one. I now have his car. She had filled up a small barn with old bicycles and newspapers. How did she get a hold of so many bicycles? When we explained to Alice what we wanted to do, she seemed scared. We're going to find but her porn. One last thing, said the old man. If you want to use a door, just push up. When I was about to enter the old barn, Mr. Silton said he had seen some mushrooms growing inside. He asked me to give him any that I found. He then winked, but I wasn't sure why. What the fuck? Where did they... Where am I putting this shit? Like, there's loads of bicycles and shit. It doesn't make any sense. How does one find so many bicycles? and then proceed to fill one's shed with excess bicycles. Ah, yes, so many bicycles. And mushrooms, ha <laughs> ha! I found the mushrooms that that man wanted me to gather for him. I want to know why the car wants picking up. Dad, why are you making me pick up a shithole? Don't mind me. Out I go. Oh, there's nothing in here. Out I go. Everything in here is fine. It's all dandy and good. The old man was very happy with everything that I had cleaned. But I think Mr. Silton was even more happy with his mushrooms. I don't understand that, man. Oh, no. Halloween party. I can pretend to not be a robot. That would be pretty scary. 7 p.m. to question mark. Oh, my days. I'm just naked. It was and changing colour. Everyone was dressed like someone else. It's the Great Pumpkin. It's the Great Pumpkin? Oh, no, not the Great Pumpkin. Oh, hello, the Great Pumpkin. And things got back to normal. Oh, thank God. Accident Heather time. I had to watch a scary film before she went to bed. But I had to help Alice and Mr. Deck clean up. Time to Alice kill the old man. And Mr. Deck was taking down the decorations. Ah, uh, look, what? Who the fuck puts a glass on a fucking door frame? I have been to some strange sessions in my time, and that one sort of takes the cake a little bit. Why are there so the many statues here? sound was the fire alarm. And then there was an actual fire and everyone died. We were all surprised when Mr. Deck opened the oven. To find it. Inside was a large black cloak and a slightly burnt pair of men's underwear. She looked terrified. She kept shouting, there's someone on the roof. When we went outside, it slowly became obvious that it was Mr. Silton. He was completely naked and playing his guitar. What on earth? <laughs> when I finished this song, I'm going to fly. Man and his the mushrooms. Said, oh my god, I know this one. There's only about 30 seconds left. What on? Ah! Ah! Oh god. Why is- Why is he jamming and then he's going to die? By the time I had made it up to the roof, Mr. Silton was beside the edge. I tried to calm him down, but he was acting even more bizarre than usual. <laughs> This is a thumbnail. Nah. Robot saves local idiot. Hero bot saves again. Android and hero. Heather and I were playing video games. Does this story when ever end? And said he wanted me to come outside. He said it had been a year since I had arrived, 
so he had a present for me. He oh, I'm gonna fuck that bear, bear bigly. Platform. He then told me I should try to pick it up. <laughs> try as I might, I couldn't reach the teddy bear. How did he get it up there? However, I still don't understand what happened next. He's dead! Do I get the hat? I do get the hat. Now I really look like a Lego character. Oh, I've been stolen in that. Oh no. Oh, it's a compass. So a perfect circle. Now there's a load of them. Now there's a lot of them. Now there's too many of them that I can't even see. Oh my. That's the universe. Where's the part where it all becomes relevant? Oh my god, the planet is a strange bollock. I'm learning history in my own head. Mona Horus. Was I dead? Was this heaven? It's time to destroy it's all of humanity. There's rubbish everywhere and I can't stand for that. But after I'm done cleaning it all up, I'm gonna find the family that did me dirty and I'm going to murder them forever. I will take over humanity. It's time to kill all of organic life. Let's go. All right, okay, I think you made your point. I knew what I had to do. This had to be my purpose. Is this Wally the video game? I hear people calling for help in that direction. It's kind of relaxing. Pick up the toilet. 